congenital cardiac surgery community is international and it's a very small community. And uh, many of us in the U.S. were fortunate to be able to train overseas in London at the Great Ormond Street Hospital. Many people have trained in, in Australia or other international hospitals. This has a great benefit of broadening our experience, fostering international collaboration, friendships and relationships that last a lifetime. We learn from each other and that, that's hugely important. Unfortunately, because of some of the changes in the training guidelines from the ACGME, it's now that opportunity has diminished. And I think it's very, very important to try to maintain and reconnect between surgeons in North America and those throughout the world. The Gra Graham Traveling Fellowship has given surgeons from around the world the opportunity to, tr to study in the United States. We hope the Mark De La Law Fellowship will give surgeons who are training, early, trainees and early career surgeons in North America the opportunity to travel around the world and build the same type of relationships that many of us were able to in the past. I think Bill gave a very nice answer. Maybe i just add one or two little points. The Mark de Laval Fellowship is the second of the AATS Grand Foundation honoring our mentor program fellowship. And uh, I see it as a confirmation of one's career and also recognition of a possible future leader in the field of pediatric cardiac surgery. I think that's very important uh, to acknowledge someone who has contributed so much to um, uh, mentor training, you know, um, young surgeons. I think that uh, this will motivate um, young um, uh, trainees, residents, and you know, junior uh, surgeons who would uh, uh, try to follow um, in the footsteps of uh, some of the important contributions that Mark de Laval has done. At the same time, it sort of consolidates sort of his work, his uh, life of work uh, in this area. Well, I think all of us who train with Dr. De Laval, it's, it's a way to give back. It's a fellowship that is unique today because a lot of us have training programs that's focused on just our institution. And I think it really is important for residents and fellows to see other institutions and how things are done elsewhere. And I think this is going to allow that for certain fellows, fellows who get this fellowship. It'll be a, a real opportunity to see how it was maybe 20 years ago when we would travel around and see other programs.